All right, welcome back, everybody. This is the club tournament of champions. We are in Utah, about an hour north of Salt Lake City, Utah. So picturesque. You're seeing a lot of the looks around this great state right here on your screen. And the play is matching these beautiful vistas. And now it's time for the ladies to take the court. And we've got a good one coming up for you. It's our first look at the Waters. They are the two seed, and they're going to be playing Vivian David and Susanna Barr, who beat Melinda Wilkins and Etta Wright 11-2, 11-6 to get here. The Waters, as you see in their matching Fila outfits on the far side, they're wearing the teal. And then you've got Vivian David in the purple and the baseball hat, and then Susanna Barr using that new Selkirk Labs paddle. Got the Selkirk tank top on. This is gonna be a fun one. David and Barr are not to be underestimated. Get a lot of balls back. David has one of those very compact, dangerous two-handed backhands. They will be looking to score the upset. Anna Lee Waters has already punched two tickets to championship Saturday. She will play the singles against Leah Jansen. She will play mix with Ben Johns against Callie Smith, the local favorite, and A.J. Kohler. That will be on Fox Sports 1 tomorrow at 4 o'clock mountain time, so don't miss that. We'll have a great call for you for that. We look forward to having pickleball again in front of a national audience on Fox Sports 1 tomorrow night. So the wind heavily at the back of the waters to start this match. When you got the wind plus the altitude, you probably want to prefer to play into the wind. So uh, we are ready to play. It is Anna Lee Waters to serve. Let's play pickleball. Hello, ladies, and they're off and running. There's that compact two-handed backhand I talked about. Vivian David will be there with that all day long. So into the wind on that two-handed backhand roll for Barr. You're going to have to get that up more than you think because the wind will be knocking it down. But then you can use that to your advantage because it will dive even lower. Right up. Bar and Lee Waters like to run around that backhand and hit this topspin forehand zero, zero dink. One. So it'll be interesting to see how that battle transpires. Oh my. And the ball off the tape hits Vivian one. David's paddle. So get that squared away. Bill Reitz is our head referee and Damon Barry assisting. Oh. Anna Lee unable to finish that shake and bake, but the waters will be bringing heat the entire day. It's a nice finish by Susanna Barr there. She's one of the best communicators. You'll hear her talking yours, mine, throughout the match. That will sail deep because of the wind. So good pressure. Lots of smiles. There will always be a smile in Vivian David's face. Going to have to hit seven winners against these two. They will keep putting the ball back in play. Go. 
And we got the push off by Susanna Barr. We'll get a look at that here. See that foot in the kitchen and then pushes off to hit it. A ancillary benefit of lobbing is that call right there. Hard to hit a return deep with the wind in their face, but Susanna Barr, that got a little behind her and really clocked it. And it's Anna Lee Waters that uh, speeds it up there. See, they like Anna Lee now playing the left side. Good finish by Barr there. Santa Lee Waters tried to curl that over there, but with the wind at her back, harder to make that dip. That time it kisses the net, but goes wide. That's just a ridiculous angle by Annalie Waters here. Just rolls that with the left hand. That's the benefit of the two-handed back, and you can really use the left hand. Oh, my. And Susanna Barr definitely played a ball that was sailing deep. Great scamper by Anna Lee to track down that lob. What a point. And it is the lob from Lee Waters that actually ends up being the difference maker here. David goes inside out into a dangerous land there, which is the two in it back end of Annalee Waters, but uh, survives it. So quick early lead for the Waters here. This is their first match of the day. Had a bye as the second seed. Waters got what she wanted. Saw one of those delicious third shot rolls from Susanna Barr there to start and get them in a good position. Then gets too much of the serve. So second serve. Vivian David retreating, leaves it wide. And Anna Lee Waters, you see there, to serve up two. Nice little hop in the transition area from Lee Waters, throws it at Susanna's feet. Well done. That serve was Really close, if not deep, but played by Barr. So, good karma on that one. Perfect lob. Again, lobbing into the wind is the way to do it. Throw it over their head and then let the wind bring it down. So, perfectly executed there by Barr. And, uh, a very nice cheer between each winning point, as you see it right there from Barr and David. So playing with a lot of fun.
And it is Anna Lee Waters who's able to catch Vivian David there after a very nice exchange at the kitchen line. flashes by. All right, working on some audio difficulties here. We're, we're back. Vivian David serving. Five, six, 
Okay, folks, again, battling the audio demons, but uh, here we go. Barr thought she caught the line there and called wide, so... We have a timeout called by Barr and David. So we will take a quick break ourselves and be back with a conclusion of game one right after this. All right, welcome back everybody. Dave Fleming here and it is the ladies on the court. The water's in a great battle here in game one with Vivian David and Susanna Barr. And Viv does not get extra points for catching that one, but uh, smiling as she always is. So uh, again, that's the way this match is going to be blunt force trauma from the waters versus the redirects, the resets, and the counters from Barr and David. It is 9-5-2. That sails deep. So let's see if David and Barr can make a run. 5-9-1 is our score. Coming cross court up high. That is not going to work against this duo. Second throw. Got some debate with the referees here. I think we had a incorrect receiver, but uh, the ball was missed anyway, so you don't get double points for that, though, just to be clear. There is no two-point play, maybe someday down the road, but uh, here we go. Six nine two. Oh, and Anna Lee thought that lob was going to get what? over Lee, and she was actually able to get it there and then thrown back where Anna Lee came from, and they're within two here. Excellent fifth by Susanna Barr there. And Anna Lee can't scrape that one back over. And will the Waters use a timeout? They will not. It is 8-9.
And the counter what? works again, and we are tied at nine. And it is time for a timeout for the water. So, big comeback. David and Barr are smiling. They're smiling whether they're down or whether they're on a rampage. Well, they are on a rampage now. So nine apiece. Will they be able to take it all the way home and take game one? We'll find out after this. Welcome back, everybody. Packed in here. And what a match. Nine apiece. David and Barr have come all the way back in. They take the lead after the water's timeout and a deep serve into the corner is followed by an even deeper return in the corner and they get the ball back. So timeout wizard strikes. And the counters were working, but then the speed up from David is countered by the waters and they are able to get to 10, and we've got a game point. That's a big drive from Lee Water. So, great comeback by Barr and David to get all the way to nine apiece with the ball, a timeout, and then it is Lee and Anna Lee taking the next two points. Will they take game two? We'll find out after this. And we're making sure we get the right server here. Misreturned by Barr there again. Uh, getting our audio square for you guys. Nice volley by Barr there. And Annalie Waters unable to dig it. And we're at 0 1 1 here, game number two. And uh, again, dialing in the thirds, it's different on both sides. The wind at your back makes it harder to leave it up because you think you hit it perfect and the wind carries it. There's a butte by Susanna Barr there. And we've got the reverse flipsy here of the waters under attack. But they are able to get back in it with a little help of a net cord. So, Barr and David smiling. Good point. Just couldn't get the finish. Nice finish by Susanna Barr there. So, again, we're at 1 0 2. That's a nice finish. Beautiful drop left up and then nice. Don't need to hit that ball hard. Just placement over power. Anna Lee got what she wanted. Couldn't finish that one. Sorry, mother. And that backhand's pulled a little wide, so David and Barr on the board.
That's a good job by Barr and David of keeping the ball down. They know if it's up at all, the Waters will be coming after it. So two apiece, game two. The winner of this match will play the three seed. Catherine Parento and Leah Jansen are through to the semifinals after beating Tarashenko and Gretchkina. The other semifinal will feature the four seed Jesse Irvin and Anna Bright against the top seed Lucy Kovalova and Utah's own Callie Smith. That just sails deep from Vivian David. Three, two, two as Lee Water serves. Played her tennis at South Carolina. That is a great Four. dig by Lee Waters there. The return was terrific. Anna Lee threw it into the negative jet stream, so it dove down, and Lee Waters was able to dig that out. Great ball by Barr there again, just the right amount of topspin and catches just inside the line there. So they get it back, they need to go. Get a miss return, that's a nice way to mount a comeback. It just keeps coming back, but there too much came back. So second serve. That comes up just short. Barr loves to roll that topspin, but hasn't found the right range with the wind at her back. Lee Waters tries to speed that up, but misses. Second opportunity. And that is pretty. Nice two-handed backhand roll there by Anna Lee. Lee Waters unable to scrap that back, so they get something there, and the lead is four. Excuse me, three, three, six, one. That's a great job by Anna Lee Waters. Stuck her paddle into the middle on the one before and was out of position, and then back door wide open. Good finish there. And this looks like the comeback they had in game number one where they got it to nine all. Great finish by Susanna Barr. Five, six, one. That third sails a little wide. Second chance here to tie this up at six. And the ball off the tape stays in. David's head shoots up into the heavens like, come on, man. Six, five, one. 
There's a what? nice finish on the shake and bake, and we're at 7 5. Open court, well played on both sides. That's one of those where. The disguise was not there on the lob, so easily able to get back and put it down as the lob was into the wind, but not from a great position. Lee Water steps back and rolls it low, and it's unable to be blocked back in the kitchen. But they get a miss return, they'll take that. Six, seven, two. Six, seven, two. And David tries to go speed up land and uh, gets beat on that one. So they get to within one, got a little momentum there. Nice volley by Susanna Barr on the drive that was up. Yeah, I think that ball was called out and that was clearly in. So uh, Anna Lee looks back. I think Lee was had her head turned around, but uh, that ball, that ball is definitely in. Anna Lee saw it, and uh, we got the proper call there. So. over on a little skitter off the tape so uh, cannot tie it at seven so we are back at seven six one what a third by Anna Lee Waters there just over the tape and they get a missed return, and that could create a timeout. Let's see what they decide to do. They do indeed call timeout. So, Waters are up 9-6 here in game number two. We'll be right back for the conclusion after this. Just too quick. All right, welcome back, everybody. Dave Fleming here with you all day long here at the Club Tournament of Champions, and it is the Waters who are having quite a battle. Up 9-6 here in game two. Yes, yes. Call on the score again. Nine, six, one. Second throw. Second chance to get to 10. It's a great deep return, so uh, fortuitous timeout. Ooh, 
Ooh. So Anna Lee Waters pulls the trigger, gets a high ball, and puts it at the feet of Vivian David, who can't dig it out. That's going to go wide. So good job by Barr and David. Can they get a few more? 7-9. Bar gets jammed. She comes in very heavy, holding that two hands. If you get it to the right side of the body, it makes for an awkward ball and just couldn't quite get the paddle in the right place. And just a gorgeous little two-handed backhand roll from Anna Lee Waters. It's one where you want to see left side player close the middle and not let that happen and we've got a match point here and that will do it so it is the waters who play a very game bar and david so they will move on it is the waters the two seed will play katherine parento and leah jansen the three and Kovalov and Smith will play Irvin and Bright in the other. We'll have all the semifinals after this.